Okay. Day three. Uh, there's my cooler. I'm not using it a lot. I should be using it more. I did laundry today. So, uh, I have my sheet off of my folding bed. Got all my clothes rolled up here. Got to put them up into the that somehow that's already got lots of stuff in it. Uh, last night was better. I slept four hours. It was a little bit cooler by the time I laid down because I didn't lay down until it got later. If I wait, it's easier. I'm doing this to show you all the stuff. I decided to put my blanket and my uh, sweater under the bed because uh, I'm not using it. It's just not cold enough. And it's too close to where I can pull it out if I need to. So, here's what I have going. It's getting a little bit better every day. I go through another bag. I've got two bags up front that I really need to go through. And that, I need to get back on the 21 day fix. But I need a 240 Jackery <laughs> to, before I can because uh, a big part of that is my uh, daily shake, which tastes awesome. But not unless it's really shook good and I have a bullet that I can do with the jackery. But right now it's just got stuff in it. So I have two bags, this size bag, full of stuff. One has all my medicine. I, I don't even know what's in the other one. Um, but I'm getting to where I'm getting things in my drawers. This is food. This is uh, soap. Laundry soap, dish soap, and I don't know what else. This is this and that and t'other. See, here's how I have this set up. I had this was part of the car. This is part of the car, so it's tight enough to where it's keeping it in place. This is the uh, non-tension rod that I have. It's just sitting here for the hell of it. I mean because uh, I got too long of one also, obviously, because it's not stretched out at all. And it goes from one end to the other. So I should have gotten a smaller size to begin with. But I'll work on that. That's not urgent. But um, once I get the sheet on, it's tonight, it's kind of muggy right now, but it's, I don't know, uh, it's um, supposed to rain. Hallelujah. That means it's going to cool off beautifully. And I'm going to sleep like there's no tomorrow. I'm at my son's mobile home. Oh, looky, I got to get that. Okay. So tonight, I'm expecting to sleep even more than four hours. <laughs> In the next two, three days, it says it's going to get cooler. So, should be able to do fairly well. Isn't this sad? This is just a sad mess. <laughs> However, it's going to work out. And yesterday I was a little bit, last night I was a little bit uh, frustrated. I, <laughs> I think somebody got to see my frustration. I don't know what I'm doing here. Um, <clears throat> actually, I've had the volume turned all the way down, so maybe you won't hear any of that. I don't know. Um, I was just showing you. I'm out of breath. <laughs> uh, anyway, tonight should be better because it's going to rain. And uh, I was frustrated trying to figure out if I should get a whole two room 
hotel room last night and uh, <laughs> talked myself out of that once I realized it would take up about a fourth of my entire monthly budget to rent a room, which is stupid. So <laughs> I sat in the front seat until it got later and I guess it was about 12.30, a little after midnight. And I didn't wake up until 4.30, so I got a, I got some good sleep. It had cooled off enough, and today it's been windy, and it's, it's definitely going to rain. So I'm really keeping my fingers crossed. Today's going to be better. I uh, also found out that uh, every truck stop, even if it's the same company, is not the same. Because... I found one uh, 15 miles further north, <laughs> thinking it would be cooler. <laughs> uh, and uh, they don't allow overnight parking for cars, only trucks. Let's go figure. Luckily, it was only 15 miles or so, so I just came back here to the truck stop that I knew would let me stay. Oh, uh, well, it wasn't any cooler anyway. Uh, okay, that's all for tonight. Um... Moving right along. We're getting there. I did laundry. I have clean clothes. My second oldest grandson graduated today, so I went and had lunch with them. Lunch? I guess it'd be lunch. I, I have a little goodie box of leftovers, so it's also my dinner. Can't wait. It's a great place. It's called Fire and Sugar or something like that. Uh, barbecue. Mm. Very good. Okay, um, and uh, um, if there's anything wonderful happens tomorrow, I'll go ahead and post, but I'm not going to do it unless it's, you know, major changes, because it's silly to do it every day if there's nothing new to tell you. Right? Right. Okay, have a good day. Um, turning it around. Turning it off. Follow your bliss. Be happy. Be healthy. Uh, and don't sweat the small stuff. It always gets better. Love y'all. Bye. Oh, I wanted to say one more thing, too. I've got like 37 followers. Far out. I have no idea who you are or why you find it interesting enough to follow me, but I'm just really thrilled with that, and I just think you're all just wonderful. And I got a, such a nice comment from Gypsy. You're a sweetheart. You just made my day. I was feeling down. Uh, it's amazing what little things, you know... Well, perk a person up. That's why I always try to say nice things to people, because they may just need to hear something nice and you don't realize it. Anyway, love y'all. Take care. Have a good day. Bye.